taong 2010, nang unang magharap ang ating kababayan na si Marvin Sonsona at ang maangas na Puerto Rican boxer na si Wilfredo Vasquez Jr. para sa bakanting WBO Super Bantamweight World Title. Doon nga ay nagawang manalo ng Puerto Rican boxer sa pamamagitan ng 4th round knockout matapos tamaan ng body shot si Marvin Sonsona. Makalipas ang mahigit apat na taon matapos ang kanilang unang bakbakan, ay nagkaroon ng pagkakataong makabawi si Marvin Sonsona kay Wilfredo Vasquez Jr. Dahil nagkaroon ng rematch ang dalawa noong June 7, 2014 upang paglabanan ang bakanting NABF featherweight title. Katulad ng dati ay hindi pa rin nawawala ang kaangasa ni Wilfredo Vasquez Jr. Sa katunayan ay noong mga nakaraang laban din nito ay niyabangan din nito ang isa pa nating kababayan na si Nonito Dunayre Jr. Ang rematch nila Sonsona at Vasquez ay ginanap sa Madison Square Garden sa New York City. At bago ang kanilang bakbakan ay may baong kartada si Marvin Sonsona na 18 wins, 1 loss, 1 draw at may 15 KO. Habang si Wilfredo Vasquez Jr. naman ay may record noong 23 wins, 3 losses, 1 draw at may 19 KO. Halina mga boss at muli nating balikan kung paano bumawi ang ating kababayan sa mayabang na Puerto Rican boxer. Wilfredo Vasquez, more experienced, was able to beat Sonsona to the punch, control the action, and ultimately wrecked him with body shot. And right now, it is Vasquez Jr. who goes down on a body shot. Yes, Sonsona has wrecked him with body shots this time. How ironic was that? So Sonsona remembered what Vasquez did to him with body shots and starts it out that way in round number one. Watch your hits. He was all but a basket case in the fighter meeting yesterday. Where a guy, Sansona, who was wrecked, knocked out in four rounds the first time around. Got knocked out. Those are the hardest ones to recover from. Which got into professional boxing without any previous amateur career, despite... And that probably came from experience. Donaire's four opponents in 2012, the year in which Donaire... ...that we've determined is probably going to wind up talking to Vasquez through the butt. Good right hook by Sonsona. Good left hand by Sonsona. By the way, Chavez Jr. too. That's what I'm saying. They come He's such a, an old school... Uh, Those three guys have to be my top three to have accomplished so much. <laughs> you know who else goes on that list? James Tony. Yeah, unbelievable. Yep. He was schooled by a letter from scorecard at the bottom of the screen. No, no, no. For coming back from the early body shot knockdown in round one. Still turn a fight around in a moment, but Vasquez... There's nothing wrong with the man he got that's giving him the, the, the and he's a half decent pool player. <laughs> Meaning that he can't beat you? Well, he come close sometimes. These guys that are usually winners, and they're winners 95% of the times that you see him in the ring. To go. When Sansona was similarly wild, effective early. That he shies away from the guy he was early in this fight as Vasquez starts to. You gotta be careful doing it though, because just like that, Sansona is capable of landing a one one punch or yep. uh, fight ending punch at any time. Yeah, you can see the physical talent at Sansona. Well, the one time party animal of Manila <laughs> says three. And it probably was really a legal punch. The defense a little bit lower below the belt line. Oh, good upcut Sansona just threw. Good body shot by Sonsona. That hurts Vasquez. Sonsona's talent is starting to rise again. He pins Vasquez into the corner. He when he was getting nailed. Good uppercut on him too. Charge it there. I thought 
Sansone. Maybe a little sign of Sansona thinking. Sansone even in favor of Sansona, but of course. Vasquez feels like he's got a. talent when he does that, but his inability to... Oh, good uppercut by... Good hard right hand by Vasquez up the middle. Fredo Vasquez might try to counter it with a right. To make this at close quarters. Even that kind of sloppy fight, I think, favors that. Oh, good hard right, right hand. hand by Vasquez. Wow. And I told you. Oh, another good right hand. Why would you keep focusing on the head? He can come back. And gave it away with a low blow in round. That it's consistently Sansona in this fight who tries to include him when they were tangled on the rope and it looked like he was leaning on Vasquez's leg. Hey! Donaire, lost in the support system that other fighters have, where these kind of... ...nap on his punches. Putting his weight on the back of Vasquez, his head in the clinch. You get to see the action flow freely. The early storm, he'd outbox him, and now, who knows? Oh, Russell said shot. Matapos ang sampung rounds ng bakbaka ng dalawa, ay nakuha ni Marvin Sonsona ang panalo sa pamamagitan ng split decision. A split decision and now the NABF champion, marvelous Marvin Sonsona! And because there was Marvin Sonsona... Sa darating na March 20, 2022, ay muling magbabalik aksyon si Marvin Sonsona sa ibabaw ng lona matapos ang mahigit tatlong taon ng pagpapahinga nito sa boxing. Bago tayo matapos ay shoutout muna sa ating mga tagapanood. Hanggang dito na lang mga boss, sana nagustuhan nyo ang ating video. Salamat sa panonood.